yeah I'm back again guys and this is the fun part about checking swarm traps or about setting up some swarm traps I was just home maybe about an hour ago it was raining and then the sun comes out for the evening and I was just there smoking a little bit and chilling and then I just said to myself I'm gonna check a few swarm traps so I decided I'm gonna check the ones that are nearby so I started to walk and I just passed two swarm traps out there that I did not check and on my way to check in the swarm trap I'm saying there's a catch there today somewhere I don't know where but there's a catch there somewhere today and this is what I see when I comes up this is a swarm trap that I set up well set up about four days ago to be exact maybe five to be exact I came here about two days ago to check the swarm trap out I saw there was cult bees checking out the trap going in and out and I decided as I said just sitting there chilling having a drink having a little smoke and just said I'm gonna check a few swarm traps and this is what I'm seeing a lot of bees a swarm moved into the swarm trap And like I said before, you don't have to take anyone's advice. You don't have to take mine. You don't have to take anyone's advice on catching honeybees. All you have to do is just make sure that your swarm bucket is prepared properly and set up in a clear, as you can see, clear. Right around it's very clear for honeybees to enter into this zone to go where the swarm trap is. Right around you could see. And you want to know the funny thing about this. I only set this trap here because right down there maybe about... 200 feet or maybe more there is a water hole you can see it right down there there is a water hole and then you have a clear and obvious entry for bees as Bees are still coming in and they're coming in from that direction over there. Most of the bees, as you can if you can see them, they're zooming out over there and zooming back to this side. Now let's get back to the swarm. And I'm not wearing any bee suit today. They are calm today. They are very calm today. No bee suit. But it doesn't seem to me as if they are going into the bucket or the bucket is already packed with bees. I can't say for sure 
but this time of the evening uh, it's 11 minutes after 6 o'clock on a Monday and we have a swarm hashtag bee bucket and this is swarm number 15 So probably we will we'll see what happens within the next half an hour to 45 minutes because as you can see the sun is setting over in the west but it's still shining. That's all bees and I could guarantee you that most of them or some of them is already in the bucket so I'll just give them maybe a day or two to see what they will do if they will move in permanently or they are gonna get up and upscon at this moment I'm not seeing any waggle dance anywhere in the cluster so I would say they are thinking about moving in so we'll just see when I check back on them in about the next hour or two to see if they move in if they do not move in I'm not gonna take them up I'm gonna leave them there to see if they will go in so I'm not gonna rush them the last time I did that they absconded and left me so I'm not gonna rush them they came here on their own they scout out the bucket and they came here on their own so I'm gonna let them decide on their own if they're gonna stay or they're gonna go because to me if the trap was not enticing and if the trap was not up to their standard they would not have came here and I know they have scouted out more than one place before they came here so let's give them a little bit more time and see what's gonna happen for them and please remember to like share and subscribe to my channel I need all you all help to build my subscriber ratings please subscribe to my channel so that I can post a longer video and better videos without using an editor but it's a pretty good bundle of bees right now as I said I could guarantee you that bees are already inside the bucket so maybe I see a bees within the cluster trying to do a waggle dance or something I don't know if you guys can see that bees in the cluster there but anyway I'll give you guys a further update on this swarm but for now they are here and they're clustered under the bottom of the bucket they're clustered all over the entrance so that's why I think maybe the queen is in the bucket or this bucket is packed with bees but let's just see what happens oh yeah the bucket is packed with bees it's almost as if bees just fell down into the bucket 
where they were clustered into the top. And I could hear that alarm that they send off when you bother the bees. So a lot of bees is in the bucket for sure. Okay. Let's see what I'm going to do. I'll give you guys a further update soon. Thanks for watching and thank you all for your support. Try a thing bees, signing out.